I remember every moment, every moment, and I can replay it over and over. It was a Thursday, so my girlfriends and I usually get together. One friend is, uh, she works in a nursing home, and she, she recognized that my face was drooping, and she said, no, let's go to the hospital right away. And the conversation was intense. My friends were yelling from the back seat to the other friend driving to say, drive faster, drive faster. My body was preparing to die, it just let go. They got me to the hospital. I couldn't do anything, I couldn't speak. I couldn't gesture, I, there was no movement. My body was numb and I was immobile. A stroke can be very devastating because uh, it occurs suddenly. The time frame for treating a stroke is extremely short. Within minutes, brain cells begin to die. This is a disease where the ability to make a difference is counted in minutes and hours. Every 30 minutes that a stroke goes untreated, the chance of having a good outcome decreases by about 10%. We've been working on developing a drug called NA1 that, if it's given in the appropriate time window, dramatically reduces the amount of brain damage that occurs. It allows the brain to hold its breath for longer, but currently it needs to be given through an intravenous, and patients and their families often would not be able to do that. We're exploring the possibility of being able to give this drug kind of like an EpiPen through an injection into the muscle. Without organizations like the Heart and Stroke Foundation that continue to fund research, without public awareness, we would never be where we are today with the NA1 program. Please make a donation today to fund breakthroughs. Life, we don't want you to miss it.